Yes, so these are historical artifacts, really, and so we want to make sure we're doing our due diligence to preserve it, which, you know, involves just winding through the film and looking for any issues there might be, noting it on a condition report, looking for things like any kind of damage to the film, creating new preservation elements, in this case it'll be digital elements, and that will preserve them for a very long time, but then we're also going to keep the original films if we send these off to our off-site storage facility. They can last hundreds of years in the right storage conditions. The particular film that I was looking at, that's footage of Phil Oakes, and he's one of our collections that we have here, the Phil Oakes Papers. He was interviewing the Swedish ambassador to Chile. Regarding human rights, uh, that we have to continue. And also that governments don't give them military aid or uh, financial aid. Um, some countries have given much and uh, the junta can exist only thanks to this aid. So that is also very important. We have both the Phil Oakes papers and the Michael Oakes collection. Michael Oakes was Phil Oakes' brother. I think in both cases, the family of Phil Oakes donated the papers for Phil and also the Michael Oakes collection. The ultimate goal is to send it to a preservation laboratory. It was really specialized in handling film. They'll also do an assessment of the films too on their side, just to catch anything we might have missed here. They have really nice film scanners that they'll run the film through. Then we'll get digital copies of the footage. Mm -hmm.